I've sounded the horn. Team Sean, assemble for me. I'm really glad when people watch these individually and they're like, what is he talking about? If they come in on this one, they deserve to not get the joke. They immediately just click off. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, let me just press play on this video. I've never watched before. (laughs) Nope. Out. Okay. No, I'm not doing that today. That was a waste of three (laughs) seconds. Just check out episode six for reference. (laughs) I'm just out completely. I don't want anything to do with this guy. All right. Well, this is You Don't Know Jack. Michelle and I have decided to band together for victory. Don't agree with him. We have an alliance. <laughs> exactly. She has a horn. I have a horn. Everybody has a horn. And we're sounding him for our fans. Horn horn. Chris, Chris oh, do you want to do an alliance? No. no he Who hates you. you. Everybody hates you, Dave. Who are you, Benny? <laughs> no, see, if you said yes, I'd say no. No. That, you were well, Yes, I was. Well, this, I was being honest. Yeah, those what if jokes really work for you. Lube rats, gerbil, and road increase. Yeah. I have no okay. Idea. All right, Michelle, here we go. So when you see Vaseline, that's the right answer. Exactly. Or maybe Splinter. He was a legend. Oh. Yeah. So many options. To begin with, you say stupid things on stage. <laughs> oh, he says tomato. Like Dave on the show every day. No one. One of the great traditions of theater is to take along some fruits and vegetables and throw them at the actors if you are dissatisfied with their art. Say you're watching a horrible passion play, so you start hurling passion right. fruit at the actors. Okay. If the lead actor stays in character, what would he say? Let he who is without sin cast the first fruit? What fruit through yonder window breaks? I want to suck your fruit. Or ho ho ho! I got it. Think I'll I mean, a I got cake. it. I got it. <laughs> In a way that I don't think is what they're looking for. Player one, watch the time. Or maybe I didn't get it. <laughs> uh, I got it. They're Player talking four? about Passion of the Christ. They are talking about Passion of the Christ. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, hmm. It's a kumquat. No, they're not talking about Shakespeare. Players one, two, and three. Now, Passion Play is a play about Jesus. And Jesus is is a play one. by Jesus. Jesus, <laughs> Jesus actually wrote this play. Zone. <laughs> and as Mel Gibson said to paraphrase, Thank you, that Mel Gibson is actually the only reason why I knew the answer to this question. Because <laughs> of his movie. Oh, was that it? Okay, oh. thanks. <laughs> Well, you sounded confused. Because of that I I could just hear it in your in your grunts. Exactly. What would Al Roker say to really hammer home that he's at his most elevated state of happiness? I'm on Cirrus Cloud 9. I'm on Allostratus Cloud 9. I'm on Stratus Cloud 9. Uh-huh. Or I'm on Cubus oh, Cloud 9. I would have known this 10 years ago, Christ. too. I'm yeah. pretty sure I know it, but I'm not sure. Are you just saying yeah. that so I don't screw you? Do I have a decent guess? No, actually, I'd love for you to screw me on this one because I'm pretty sure I'm right. Hello! Hi. Hello! How are you? Hey, Cookie, how's it going? Players one and three? No! <laughs> no! Players two and four? Oh. <laughs> it was one of those Whoa. two. So, yeah, Sean, you should have screwed me. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> Strong it's showing so for everyone. <laughs> Cirrus clouds are considered high clouds. High clouds, That's like oh, Sean's I thought that fans. was Circus <laughs> Cloud 9! Damn it! Thousand feet. Circus? <laughs> Wouldn't you be at your most elevated state of happiness at a circus? Okay, well, clearly no, it's not going to be circus, Cloud. That's just stupid. <laughs> I can just picture Al Roker going to the circus with a big smile plastered on his face. <laughs> oh, hey, look, the threes look like they're in a circle. You really bring everything home, Dave. Yes! Segways. Hey, remember the miracle on the Hudson? You know, the hero pilot that landed U.S. Airways Flight 1548 right there on the Hudson Who? River? It was like the ending to a Disney movie. I half expected animated bluebirds to show up and carry the passengers No, they were sucked into the jets. Anyway, that got me thinking. The lovable captain of the Miracle on the Hudson plane shares a nickname oh, with which lovable Pixar character? The piggy bank from Toy Story, the head monster from Monsters, Inc., the lead mm. rat from Ratatouille, This is so difficult. Mm. So, so difficult. I don't know it. It's okay. Think about it. No. <laughs> think hard about it. You Think with your brain. <laughs> think with your special eyes. Where's that confounded okay, well, right didn't get it right. You didn't I almost she get it on this one. Wrong. wrong. I think rightly. you got it wrong. Chelsea, right. Sully, okay. <laughs> wrong, right. Good. And the monster, James so then our team Sully survives. <laughs> they spell their Sully's differently. And she got it one second left, but it doesn't matter. Our hearts is the same. <laughs> <laughs> this is convenient because it bails me out from having to actually know the right answer. <laughs> yeah, exactly. One. I knew the answer, and I almost hit the button, but I'm like, ah, nope, 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 rats. Good, thank you. America, I want you to know I totally would have had the right answer because I'm a genius, but I definitely intentionally went for the wrong one. Yeah, that sounds about right. So just have faith in me. Sounds about right, Sean. 
Yeah, no, wrong totally answer. The game is I'm your translator. Mm -hmm. What, my, com my Dave to commoner translator? Yeah, no, I, I speak your douchebag talk. It's a language I'm fluent in. Because you're a douchebag. <laughs> Open wide for... <laughs> I'm not going to lie with you. I'm not going to argue with you. And this would be a disrespect. For Michelle? I think what? maybe you, you can do oh, this, Michelle. No. no. <laughs> you can do it, Michelle. Oh, Michelle, you got six out of seven last time. Yeah, that time. was dumb luck. I'm read off seven totally. Or no, smart luck. You, you know you're sex and sin. Michelle, we have yeah, raspberry beer in the, in the in the fridge. Or if you get this right, I'll give you a sip. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would know the Victoria's Secret side. Hey. It's everywhere hey. rooting for me. Hey. Hey. America, hey. come on, Michelle! Press your circle button. This is right answers will give you Michelle, these are two things you know a ton about. Way. Yes. But answer wrong, I mean, you may be aren't you a Victoria's Secret Jack model? I am, and I'm a serial now, killer, so it's this. perfect. And she's she's Walking so brazen that she just admitted it on air. I was going to say, I don't know if you want to tell people that, but it's okay. Everyone who got it right will split that cash. There are worse ways to die than being killed by a Victoria's Secret model. It's really my, <laughs> like, okay, my, my really ideal way. Adrian, no, I should have known. Giselle, Rosemary, Eileen, no! Uh oh. <laughs> okay, no! Well, four out of seven. Well, four out of seven is good, though. Better than 50%. What's well, the some time, Bill? That is math. Just <laughs> that Sean which. can't do it, as opposed <laughs> to one of our previous episodes. <laughs> 350 times five, what is it? Yay! Is it a million? <laughs> 10 million. Oh, I forgot to try to steal. That, that was okay. good. Because we're a team. Oh, I and exactly. I want to steal from you. You're my partner. <laughs> we're all bunched up right now. Yeah, we were very close. All of our teams are both excited and nervous. I mean, you know, if you were a woman, that's that's what I meant. Oh. What a, did you just insult women? Yeah, he did. That was a sexist, so. or, a sexist joke. Cookie, oh. you're on thin ice. He's a fictional character. He's fine. He's bulletproof. Exactly. How about, aren't guitar teachers the real guitar heroes? Aww. I like games like DJ Hero and Guitar Hero, but I think the cast decide who the real musical heroes are. Auxiliary percussionists. <laughs> yes. Which of these games features a percussion instrument in the title? Ocarina Hero, Sitar Hero, Timpani Hero, or Susan? Wow, Sean and I Hero. tied exactly. Yes, I got it! A timpani is drum roll, please. A drum. <laughs> yeah, I get it. Okay, time to give this game a test run. Okay, here it comes. <laughs> it's coming up. Just about time. I mean, those boring game ever. Nailed it! Now I just need to wait two minutes and do it again. I love this game. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> you know. played the timpani. Yeah, the timpani. <laughs> That's how I pronounce that. In my head, it is like the sous the sous <laughs> or the ocarina. Yeah. Oh, God. Or the trumpet. Around two are worth double. <laughs> that legendary French horn instrument. Remember, you got those screws sitting there. You didn't come here to make friends. What? I did. Aww. Six is Does he a love robot. us? It's a little soon. I just no. want Dave to like me. Aww. Up next. Cue the montage. It'd be nice to me, for me to like Montages you. Montages are my favorite parts happen. of movies because you get to witness so many activities achieved in just one day. There are a lot of historical people I would love to have a montage with. People like Mark Twain, Abe Lincoln, my birth father. <laughs> well, suppose I have a montage type day with Upton Who? Sinclair. Who? Justin Based Upton? Based on the horrors you wrote about in the jungle, what would we definitely not do? Feed each other hot. See, that's my fault. It is. You know what it is, right? No! Yes! Upton no. Sinclair is the author of The Jungle, a book yes! that reveals the corruption yes! of the American yeah, yeah, yeah. Speaking of hot dogs, feast on it, Dave! <laughs> 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 okay, I would have loved to hear the actual reasoning for that answer. Yeah, well, too bad. Uh oh. Dave's controller is low. What are we gonna do if he can't play anymore? You screw the bull, you get the horn. <laughs> so what was the reasoning for that? So, I don't know. Maybe you'll look it up afterwards. Maybe Sean can't shut the hell up. <laughs> The devil was about how horrible the packing industry, meat packing industry was. Wikipedia, is. that is such a hipster thing. Between them, what would it yell? <laughs> hey you! Oh hey! Oh you! Hey you! Uh, oh god! Here's the thing. <laughs> I wish you would have buzzed in with me and got a wrong time. I could have used the you know, fix the gap. Well, there. you didn't give him time to. I don't. Know. I don't. Well, he I'm missing something here. <laughs>
a an AU Wait, is the distance between the Earth and the Sun. <laughs> See, that's what I thought, but no way. AU is the distance between Earth and the Sun. Players One AU. One, I didn't. I knew AU was AU something. I wasn't convinced it was this, unit. but it was. I was prepared unit. to know that it was 93 million miles. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh, I'm gonna get this right so quick, and then it did this, and I was like, what? <laughs> we still got it. Yeah, the sad thing was, if it had said million or billion, I would not have known the. I, I would not be able to tell you. <laughs> I knew 93, though. Next up, the 93 Dunny billion miles. Uh -oh. <laughs> so far. Uh-oh. <laughs> and another uh -oh. One's made of wood. I hate you! I know. <laughs> it's Sean. Shut up! I hate you! I haven't broken out Billy O'Brien in a while. Maybe I should take him out for a quest. He's the worst character I've ever shown. Mad ventriloquism okay. skills. Let me out! I have to take a test! Hey, Billy, haven't seen you in a while. Um... Who's your friend? Oh, there's Ninny Dagger Sawdust. It's my ventriloquist dummy, Mikey McDride. You have your own dummy named Mikey McBride? Yeah, you got a problem with that, punk? Since I was hardly getting out of the docks, I had to take out a hottie. Nasty, they'll just take out nasty. I'm embarrassed right now. Hey, Can we get to the question? The question asking. Which Thank movie you. should I move to the top of my Netflix queue if I want to launch something starring my favorite Oh my Mindy god. Star, I don't even want to get this right. The Curious Case of Dungeon and Dutton, Mr. Nagorian's Wonder in Torian, Pirates of the Caribbean, no, don't, we have a team. don't get me wrong, I don't know this anyways, but I'm glad, because I don't want to get anything associated with this guy right. no idea. What? You don't have to see more What's wrong with him? He's legit. No, not Phil Seymour Hoffman, the dummy. Oh, <laughs> gotcha, okay. <laughs> Player one. Oh. I think you're thinking of a different. <laughs> Come Hoffman. on, guys. My 25% really? chance. Ah. I actually Players love two, this three, movie, four. too. I do, too. It's yeah, fantastic. He is in that. Cool, I got it right. <laughs> you have a really great taste in movies, Nike. Oh. Thanks, Dilly. You're my best friend. I mean, it wasn't going to be no, Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> yeah, that one I sort of knew. At, <laughs> Although I have not. Well, that's the, is sorry. it the original, The Black this Pearl? Is really, really uh, yeah. Is the Curse of the Black Pearl? Yeah. Black, Black Pearl's the original. The Black okay. Pearl? No, I knew that one. That's the only one I've seen and enjoyed. The rest of them, I was like, mm. I feel like it is Curse, yeah, of, the it is curse of the Black Pearl, though. It is the Curse of the Black Pearl. family's honorable name in half. <laughs> Quote me on that. <laughs> How did David Seth Kotkin magically change his name to David Went Copperfield? Yeah. He pulled the name out of a black top hat. The copper idea came to him during a penny in the ear trick. He had a dream about it during the levitation trick. Or he just copied from the book David Copperfield. Um, oh, God. I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it either. I have a guess. Yeah. Player one. So <laughs> <laughs> I just thought it'd be cool if it was Players that way. two and three. Hey, look, your money's disappeared. Yeah, see, that one seems Player obvious, four? but... Super magically, really? he just stole it from Charles Dickens' book. Interesting. Didn't give me very many points. That's really not that imaginative. No. No. I thought it was like he wrote a book called David Copperfield <laughs> and then stole it. I was like, how does that even work? <laughs> Sean doesn't know his literature. <laughs> exactly. Self plagiarization. <laughs> That's okay, isn't it? Configuration menu. Okay, so fingerprints are apparently one of three or four different types of okay. patterns. Which of these finger foods is not covered with an officially classified fingerprint what? pattern? An arch-smeared pizza bagel, fruit smudged with a loop, a whorl-covered mini oh, quiche, God. or corn chips with a dip. Gotta go bigger, go home here. Yeah, I gotta catch up a little too. Yep. Or go further in the hole. It's bigger home. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure I know this one. God. Players two and four. Arch, loop, and whorl are apparently all types of yeah, fingerprint yeah, yeah, patterns. A dip, however, is not. I went with whorl. What'd you go with, Chris? Uh, I went with loop. Thing is oh, okay. I knew, yeah. Team Chris, you may want to start heading towards the exit. <laughs> <laughs> just yeah. beat, beat the traffic. Just, just start filing out. Uh, I'm liking I, I our, uh, to kill him. He was just our pair here. here. Yeah, wow. I mean, if you compare our scores to, to team whatever they... Well, they're not... I don't, <laughs> don't you do this to me. <laughs> we are no sorry, team. Chris. We are no team. Shot him dead. Hmm. Although, Chris, hey, I think you could make a comeback. He always does with the here. jack attack. Thing. This is this is steep though. Wait I know. For it. Yeah. Wait for it. I'm gonna need a category I can dominate. I'm gonna send this because I'm down like 3,500 now. Oh. I'm guessing it's gonna come back positive for dumb. Yeah. So why this game's fun though. Like last time uh, up to this point, you do oh I won. Oh my god, I didn't know that was the last question. Yeah. Not over, Sean. Last time at this point, you dominated, and then like this time, like I like how there's 
parody. Sorry. Yeah, I gotta lean forward a little. Uh-oh. Gotta get into it. No, and his voice got deeper, too. Jesus Christ! It's time. Oh, I can't be Dave on Sunday. is gracious. Well, you knew that one. I was actually looking for seven. <laughs> you know this one as well. Thanks, Bree. <laughs> <laughs> Got distracted. Wow. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's what I thought it was. Brownie points. Dang. Well, Whoa. Net of it wasn't on all of them, Dave. I'll definitely catch you on this way. <laughs> I have no idea on darts at all. No. Oh, good. Well, sit back a little now. Yeah. <laughs> New points. Oh, shoot. Mm. What? Oh, I knew it wasn't 50 bad. points. Dave, stop buzzing on everything. <laughs> it scared me. Let someone answer. 50 points, you win if you can play at you. <laughs> if Dave hadn't buzzed in on every single wrong answer, I think I could have caught Sean there. If you get two youth, it's game over. <laughs> But I won. I would have. Oh, God. I would have. Oh, man. Oh, that was great. Team Shots cheering because they know how to play Scrabble. Yeah. <laughs> like, I mean, David has the most money here, but how does he win ultimately? Right. Everyone just saw what just happened. Right. I tried to jump the answer because I thought that was going to be the last one, right. and it failed. It's like winning a kitten punting competition. It's like, yeah, yeah I mean, you punted the most, You're the but best. what's left of your soul after that? And I'm in last again. <laughs> it's all right. We're on a team, so we can consolidate our money. And you win. We're like big time at first with that. No, the two of you combined win. Yeah. Barely, but... And we can buy a house for our team <laughs> to go into. Right. Uh, they need a house. Wait, yeah. so you can buy a house for about $17,000, really? That way. No, yeah. Look at the down payment. House. All, of our, all our fans do is smoke weed all the time. They don't need a lot. Cardboard boxes cost Maybe. a lot less money than that. Maybe next time all your fans move into a crack house. No, no, They'll no. Step I, up. I just want to buy a small house and get some like fire insurance because all the drugs that are going to be in there and they burn the house down. Look at the fire at the bottom of the screen right now. Yeah. That exactly. could be in your house. That's what happens oh. when you smoke weed. They're actually lighting gentlemen. up with that fire. Yeah. <laughs> That's your floor. You yeah. This is like this is a Cautionary tale of the reefer. <laughs> Smoke so, weed, you're going to burn your house down. Most people just see regular credits right now, but all the people who are high in on Sean's team, they see fire. Exactly. So if and you they see fire on your screen, apparently you're a Sean fan. They're just freaking out. Yeah! Wait a minute. I see the fire. Oh my God, it's burning me. I haven't smoked pot in years. <laughs>